45-year-old man purchases medication online to treat his chronic condition, hoping for an affordable alternative to his regular prescription. After a few days of use, he notices no improvement in his symptoms and suspects something may be wrong with the product. Upon further investigation, he learns that the medicine may be counterfeit, designed to mislead consumers regarding its contents and effectiveness. Which of the following best describes this type of product? Option A, a product that is produced to deceive. Option B, a product sold at a significantly reduced price compared to the original medication. Option C, a product not approved by any drug regulatory authorities. Option D, a product manufactured in a country outside the patient's region. The correct answer, A, a product that is produced to deceive, accurately describes counterfeit medicine. Counterfeit medicines are created to mislead consumers or regulatory bodies about their origin, authenticity, or effectiveness. These products are often made to resemble legitimate medications, but may contain incorrect ingredients, contaminants, or even no active ingredients, posing severe risk to public health. Due to this deceptive nature, counterfeit medications may fail to provide the intended therapeutic effect, as in the case described. The World Health Organization, WHO, estimates that up to 10% of medications globally could be counterfeit, with higher prevalence in certain regions. Counterfeit medicines violate trademark laws and may infringe upon various drug regulations, consumer protection standards, or criminal laws.